goal was to play, I think, just one recording session a month. Well, get a load of this. Seven years later, he plays on 100 albums a year. I mean, you've heard his music on albums by Waylon, Dolly Parton, Barbara Mandrell, many others. Plus, he played on 17 of the 20 cuts on CMA's Album of the Year, Will the Circle mm. Be Unbroken, Volume 2. Well, on top of all that, he's a recording artist in his own right, and he's got a new solo album to prove it. John Davis has more. Nineteen eighty-eight was a good year for instrumentalist Mark O'Connor. He donated one of his first fiddles to the Country Music Hall of Fame. And he got a featured spot on the CMA Awards Show. This year, he picked up his fourth CMA nomination for Musician of the Year, and he recently released his new album, On the Mark. On the Mark could be possibly a, a type of music that still features my violin playing a lot, but uh, a type of music that would might have a chance, you know, with more people listening to it and enjoying it. Mark's trying for broader acceptance by hitting the road for a series of showcase concerts. It's going to be exciting, I mean, uh, to have that constant focus from the audience and uh, not letting up on you and you've got to be on top of it for a full show. I'm looking forward to the challenge. Although his music is usually in the country category, Mark's new album has been getting a lot of attention from the jazz critics. The music is closer to the realm of jazz than anything, and then a lot of it's improvised. Jazz encompasses so much and, and so many different styles that it's easy for me to fit in there. But wherever his music fits in, Mark hopes his touring schedule will generate new fans. This is more like a, a reading of, of what we're able to do. And judging from how it's reviewed and how it goes over, we'll determine, you know, the future success of the Mark O'Connor group, I guess. Oh, he is good. And I think I just proved that I am a redneck. Why is that? Because I made up a word what? for Mark. I called him a fiddler player. Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll point out here that Mark has several other solo albums out, each with his own different style. He also plays mandolin and guitar. In fact, he writes 90% of his music on the guitar and plays the fiddle. Great musician. Right. We're going to take a break and be right back. Yeah.